what's going on everybody we are headed to london london ontario um, one of our clients have purchased a trailer so we're just doing a trailer move from london to kitchener ontario so we are about half an hour away and i hope you enjoy this video Up. This is the trailer that I'm supposed to be hauling. They've got a Mustang in the back of it. And they got a trailer that they're trying to bring it down on. This is such a sketchy situation, guys. So, uh, I was told to be here for 12 o'clock. It's 12.20. I caught some traffic. And they aren't even unloaded yet. So I'm about to hop out, talk to these guys, see what the situation is. Because this is super sketchy. And then I'll call my, my dispatch and see what we're about to do here. So guys, they've got this for the trailer with the wings. to do was load that Mustang onto that trailer and fall off of the ramps so then they still determined they were still determined to uh, to pull it off then when they got some weight onto the back of the trailer the front of the trailer was coming up obviously right so then they had the Sun trying to hold it down Son, I said, buddy, if that if that car falls on that trailer, the the, the front of that trailer is gonna smack you right in the face. So now they're gonna try to hook up the trailer to this pickup, but it doesn't seem like the pickup truck wants to move. And I talked to the client, I talked to my dispatch, I let them know what's going on. Look at this, what's going on? These guys are incredible here. So let's see what happens, boys and girls. Guys, let me tell you, this is like wild. Like, you come to a job, you're supposed to grab a trailer and just head back, and then you you see all this like, I don't know, I want to call it like hillbilly kind of stuff. You know what I mean? Like, just not the way that it's supposed to be done. So there they are trying to figure it out. Sketch. Like I'm telling you, this is sketchy, sketchy. But. I get to see funny. <laughs> I get to see funny things every day of my job, which is really good. It beats being in an office. So this guy's like, you bench this truck. Check it out. Oh no! Look, 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 look. This guy is. Uh, I don't know. All right, I'll keep you guys updated. Guys, I don't want you guys to think like I'm a dickhead. You know, like I'm here laughing at these guys. I give them my opinion on what I would do. I was a professional in the situation and that's all I can do so I'm just gonna sit back and see what uh, <laughs> see their plan unfold the way that they the way that they envisioned it but there's really nothing I can do it's not my place it's not my position I offered just my opinion um, and even then I was worry to do that because then if they do it your way and then something happens it's just sometimes better to just sit back and watch the show so they are trying to load the trailer I guess hook it onto the truck and they've been doing this for the last five minutes ten minutes maybe so it is what it is let's see how this goes all right so now what they're doing is they're jacking up the car from by the diff to slide the ramp which is right there to slide the ramp back under that tire so actually oh wow both ramps came off oh my goodness because i see the guy on the other side of the car he's got a ramp in his hands and there's a ramp there on on the deck so let's see let's see oh, 
All right, well, guys, I just ate my lunch. They are still there. They had the ramps uh, put underneath the car. But uh, after speaking to my dispatch and talking to the owner or the, the buyer, the buyer of the trailer, after speaking to them, reviewing the, even the condition of the trailer, there are some tires that are dry rotted completely. And if I was to take it down the highway, it would not be safe. So. Uh, we've come to the conclusion that uh, we're going to cancel this call. We are not going to go ahead and tow this vehicle. Um, obviously, we're dealing with this issue here, and it's like accumulating time. So that right now, that our client, you know, they're accumulating charges of me just sitting here, right? Like my truck is here, so and it could be in the city or somewhere making money. So um, this is a bad situation where a seller of a product or of any item lies to the buyer the seller told the buyer that the truck or sorry that the trailer was completely empty it was ready to go good for the road and that is clearly not the case i pulled up you guys saw the car oh look, they have it moving here so they are moving it down but guys when you sell something be honest be truthful because then it could snowball into a whole bunch of people getting screwed over, right? So, not just the, the buyers getting screwed over, but I'm here wasting time. My company is wasting time and fuel and everything. So, guys, let's just be honest. It is what it is. If he said, hey, I have to pull something out of the trailer, give me another two hours, I would have went and done something else. I would have pulled over and cleaned out my truck. And you guys already know that this truck needs a good cleaning. I could have just done something like that, but... Here I am sitting down, but I mean it's content for you guys, right? So here we are watching this unfold. They're hooked up. It's already on its way out They're trying to pull it by hand now because the trailer with the winch is right here Weird 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 I mean, I don't blame them Sometimes you got to do what you got to do, you know You got to be resourceful and think outside the box, but some, at, at the other times there's the right way and then there's the wrong way and I don't think this is the right way at all so guys if you're watching this far thumbs up on the video please like comment subscribe you know the deal I really appreciate you guys oh and the, the car's going the car's going the car's going wow guys did you see that oh I hope you guys saw that oh my goodness thank god that they had tires there Wow, that is crazy. I was honestly expecting the car to go right into, oh, sorry, into the back of the pickup. I hope you guys saw that. Wow. All right, so I advised the gentleman that was uh, removing the vehicle. I advised him that the call was canceled. He looked pretty upset, but I mean, if you lie, what do you expect, right? So, call's canceled. I'm about to roll back to the city. Guys, honesty is the best policy sometimes, you know what I mean? Like, we're rolling out. The guy, he sweat himself for nothing. Who knows if the buyer is going to go through with the purchase. You know, the buyer may just say, okay, you know what? I'll send the tow truck back out there. Or the seller may have just lost. They have just lost the, mo the bag, you know? He lost the money, so... It is what it is, guys. You already know how I feel about this. And it happens, right? So back to the city I go. I went for a little nice cruise. And we will see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.